Welcome back to another uh, uh, try on from Zimnus. Zimnus. Azamnus. This. This right here. <laughs> okay, so I still don't know how to say it. If you guys missed the first one, um, that's uh, here. But if, um, you know, you watched it and you're ready to go, so le let's just go. <gasps> what is this website? I have no idea. It was one of those going out of business sales. So um, I, my friend grabbed a bunch of <laughs> So I don't really even know what is in these packages. All I know is that the three that I have today are all black and in tiny packages. As you can see here in this um, package sandwich that I have created just for you. Nom nom nom. All right, let's just open some up. Like I said in the previous episode, we got all of these in an extra large. What that really means, I'm not sure. Um, because when you're dealing with some of these websites, you have actually no idea if their sizes are standard to anything. But really, is that less like any clothing, I guess? Like, there's no set stand. Ooh, all right. Oh, oh, multiple pieces. Who would have thought such a small bag would have multiple pieces in it? All right, so the first piece because one just fell into my lap. So the first piece is a an elastic, um, what I'm assuming is a waistband, and it's mesh, completely see-through, and it actually um, is a skirt. Just It's a long skirt, goes all the way down, but um, has two slits all the way up to the waistband. So I'm assuming that that's great legs come out. So I guess let's find out what this goes on top of. Oh, she's a see-through girl. Oh, gotta love it. I can even figure out, if I can figure out how this goes. Hold on, it's Cat's Cradle right, right for a second. Look, the Eiffel Tower. Um, okay, so it's a bodysuit of some sort because I found the crotchal area. That's very important. Um, but it is a completely see-through bodysuit. So I'm not exactly sure how I'm supposed to wear a see-through bodysuit with a see-through skirt on top anywhere, but um, give it, I'll give it a go. Um, so I will be wearing undergarments, obviously. So okay, so this is the top. Then there's a lot of stringy string. This is going to take forever for me to try and get on. And then it looks like at the bottom. Um, attached to the hips are like these side things that go on my thighs so I think it's like a like a like a gar fake garter situation so fake garter some harness bits um, see-through body suit with a see-through skirt all right um, that'll be fun I was just the first thing guys what? guys this is hard this one has a little variety because it's not just black. There is some white embroidery on here. So I guess let's figure that out. Maybe this website just really likes see-through things. Because I'm seeing a lot of see-through things. Um, also, this uh, three pieces? Three pieces in that tiny bag? Maybe? I just I gotta find or something? Maybe it's a top? Maybe it's a top. Maybe not. Maybe it's bottoms. I... Okay. It might be bottoms. Okay, so it's see-through. Um, what's giving me, a, a, like, confusion is, like, here are the leg holes, I'm assuming, and this would be the crotchal area, but it's not, like, constructed like a regular crotch would be. It's just sewn together haphazardly. It doesn't even seem like proper. They have 
harnesses on them as well. So this, that was one part. This is the another part, which looks like another one of those long skirts. Does this also have the um, slits on the side? As one slit, yes. It also has a slits on the side, but here is how I'll distinguish the two because this one has a matching um, embroidered little patch here. <laughs> Great. I wonder what the top's gonna look like. So this is also completely see-through, um, and it has a lot of wivets hanging off of it, like a lot of like stringy bits here, like elastic. Um, but I can't constructionally exactly figure out which way I'm supposed to hold it right away. So I, I just have to, I have to, I have to look. I figured it out. I figured it out. Oh, that took forever. Don't do that, Jenny. Be better. <laughs> it's a halter top. Okay, so this is the top. It has this here. It has this, um band here that I believe goes on the inside like a it's supposed to c cover you um, no that's also see-through and then the back um, that's how I figured it out this is just a plain back that goes on the back so then you have tie bits and then you just have these for show oh god this is gonna be revealing Okay, so that was three pieces. So the first one was two pieces. This one was three pieces. I need to figure out how not to get them all mixed up. So I have one more item. It's a different fabric. It's a different fabric. <laughs> That's exciting. Um, it's like a silky fabric. Ooh, let me figure out what it is. One piece. It's revealing, but not as revealing as a completely see-through outfit. It has a skirt that looks kind of like an old-timey slip um, with elastic, and then it has the top attached with like those like harnessy things, um, and then the 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 boobage top area here. I hope my fit. I mean, they seem big enough for me to fit, and then. It um, goes up and ties around the back, so it's a lot. It's a lot going on here. Um, all right, so let me try this stuff on. happening. Some of these items are really confusing to just even figure out which way was up to begin with and then also put on. I know I, I should be better at putting on clothes but apparently not. <laughs> it took me an embarrassing long time <laughs> to figure some of these out. Um, and then they were very, very revealing. So if I wanted to wear some of these things out in public, I would really have to um, be creative, I suppose. We'll say, I'll be creative. Um, but other than that, if you're looking for like cheap lingerie or something to lounge about in, in the home for your mate, maybe, um, or for you, I mean, can lounge around in these at my if I had just a home for me <laughs> and just drink wine that would be wonderful I'd wear my red robe my red see-through robe with my black undergarments just feel my fantasy I love that anyway uh, I'm so excited to know that I have I think two or three more videos worth from this website and it has been a roller coaster ride so far so <laughs> uh, 
I will see you guys next time.